time. When we talk about specialty coffee, we're attracted to its origin, its process, or even the kind of roast. These offer an infinity number of possibilities. Jogens, I have a new experience for you all, the surprising connection between the coffee and sounds frequency. I was interested by knowing more about the flavor perceptions. I decided to explore, open a new door. How can I modify a sensory experience in another way? Well, imagine for a moment being able to choose a sound frequency that enhances the floral, sweet, or fruity flavors of this coffee. Well, I have found a way to make this happen. And for this presentation, I will use this small speaker because I found by exposing the instructions to the sound frequency, its structure can be altered, changing its acidity and even bitterness. After many tests with high and low frequencies, I notice my espresso exposure of 60 Hz has more balance, creamy texture, bright acidity, and more sweetness. Now, judges, I'm leaving this small speaker next to the extractions because I found by exposing the extractions to the sound frequency, its structure can be altered. Now, judges, in order to do this, First, we must choose the coffee. I'm convinced that after this experience, our first coffee is a Pacamara. I'm convinced that this is a wonderful coffee from Colombia, grown by Jorge Rojas in the beautiful countryside of Planadas, Tolima. At an altitude, 1,900 meters above sea level. This area is known to have a fertile soil and have the perfect conditions to develop this juicy and tartaric acidity. Now, judges, let's tune the espresso to explore the sound frequency in every seat. Today, I'm using 20 grams of ground coffee and 45 grams of extractions. Our TDS is 9% with 21% of extraction. Jogens, I invite you to take one of the spoons, mix the espresso in a circular way until the crema integrates with the liquid, and then you can place the spoon in the small glass. Now, Jogens, I need to wait for 10 seconds. To enjoy a this wonderful coffee. And this recipe have the perfect harmony with the 60 hertz and develop a juicy tartaric acidity. Now, judges, as I let this work covers, you will see the wave of the sound frequency I use to extract this delicious coffee with flavors of chamomile, red grapes like a red wine, chocolate, blueberries, mangosteen, medium body, a delicate aftertaste like a dark chocolate. Now, judges, it's perfect to captivate your senses in three sips. Now, judges, please enjoy it. Jogens, we roasted the coffee at inland temperature 150 degrees Celsius. 
This process was done slowly to highlight the sweetened and aromatic herbal flavors and preserve its delicate acidity with a final time of eight minutes. And development of 14%. Jogens, the complexity of this coffee requires an ideal degasing phase to be around 15 days for this experience. Using cow's milk, I executed three processes to create synergy. First, caramelization for one hour over low heat to reduce the fat. Second, Freezing it for 12 hours to concentrate the protein and the halt the caramelization process. And third, defrozen it for six hours. After this time, we remove the solid block to achieve a creamy texture and lower in fat and provides even more silkiness for this drink. Judges, by integrating the espresso exposed of 60 Hz and creamy milk at a medium temperature, I discovered the sound frequency of this blend was very different. I found the boba effect. And now, to enjoy this wonderful drink, I invite you to use the spoon. Mix only the crema until integrate the liquid and achieve a uniform color. Once done, please taste it, that you will encounter a delightful affogato with flavors of salted caramel, butter cookies, Creamy vanilla finish. Milky chocolate. Please enjoy it. And delicate nuts of orange blossom. Okay. Please enjoy it.
Now, judges, for our next experience, will we go through three phases? And I convinced that after this experience, you will enjoy a wonderful multisensory experience. And you are the protagonist of it. That's why it's important, please. You follow my instructions carefully. Sounds frequency provides even a remarkable ability to modify the liquids at a molecular level, opening up new avenues to enjoy this wonderful drink. Judges, I'm convinced that after this experience, this will be the next step on evolutions to enjoy this wonderful drink. Please, tour around with me. Clarification is a technique that allowed me to create this wonderful drink because thanks for the coffee extracted and exposed with cystic hairs and mixture of our ingredients, we achieve flavors of ginger candy, lemon, vanilla, and refreshing, juicy, prolonged finish. Now, judges, our first step is to develop the clarification, but this is the process I made to create the synergy for our ingredients. Now, together, we pour the all ingredients in the large glass, where we find when we're starting top to bottom. And our first ingredient is a curvy made with a pacamara, ratio one to six with 40 hour in immersions. We use 20 milliliters of this and provides a delicate sweetness for our drink. Delicate body for our drink. And the second ingredient, a reduction of tamarind pulp. We use 10 grams of tamarind pulp with 100 grams of water. Now, the tartaric acidity create a beautiful sweetness like a panela for our drink. And now, our last ingredient, a two-hour infusion with lemon balm. We use two grams of lemon balm with 100 grams of water. The aromatic herbal flavors create a beautiful sensation of ginger candy and lemon for our drink. And now, please help me to filter this. Usually, this process takes around for six hours. I decided to frozen the resulting filtered liquid for 48 hours because that was the best form to keep the all ingredients together. Now, judges, for enjoying this experience, will we go through three phases? And I will explain to you. Sorry. In your right side, you have a headphones. I will indicate you when you use that. Now, our first step is pour the espresso over the block of ice. Second, when you hear the first sound, take the first sip. This will be beta and slightly sweet due to the frequency we are emitting. And the third step, mix very well again the drink and take the second sip. It's during this sip I will ask you to evaluate the drink. Please, Jorgens, I invite you to use your headphones. Now, judges, it's a honor for me to share with you the reward the coffee offers us, such as this one. We could observe and taste how the sound frequency can transform a delicious cup. And thanks for your time. Time. <laughs>